Well, we didn't go far. We're stuck. I don't know whose job that is to clear that. We'll go around the other way. We got a nice sunny day. We're at the dealership. We're going to walk up and it's a moment of truth. See how it drives, see how it looks. Looking at the 2021s, they're really nice. But we're going for a 2019. Save a little off the old sticker price, hopefully. But you know, it's a lot of these are the Hemis. This one's the E-Torque. I'm really wanting not to do the E-Torque. All that extra stuff just to go wrong. And I really like this truck. He has the long bed, which is a short bed, but longer than the short short bed which is five and a half feet this one's six and a half feet you can't get an eight foot i wouldn't want an eight foot bed anyway six and a half is just right the five and a half i think looks stubby and silly and you can't put nothing in it so we'll see this one's also got the 30 was it what size tank 33 gallon 33 tank. gallon yeah. fuel tank which he paid extra for it's got the long um what do they call it the step rails yeah uh, so it goes all wheel the way, to wheel. yeah, wheel to wheel. So you can pretty much like get up in the bed by stepping on it. So it's not just done, just stop at the back door, it goes all the way back. So that's kind of cool. So we shall see. So this is it. I kind of like the paint. I don't know if it'll show up on the camera, but it's got a nice little metallic. sparkle metal to it. Uh, the front grill looks just like the 2021s, actually. Here's a 2021, 2019. Can't really tell them a diff uh, part, except that one doesn't have the uh, side steps. Eh? Seeing I'm seeing clean, clean bed. What is that, a power uh, rear window or yeah. something? This is where you see a lot of wear usually. I'm yeah. not seeing anything. Not necessarily having the new car smell, but not all bad. Sure has a huge uh, compartment there, whatever. Does it have that thing? Yeah, it does. Yeah, it's okay, the storage. Yeah. So this is some sort of a cool like a, mat type yeah. of thing. Well, there is no carpet, I don't think. Yeah, there's carpet on there. There's carpet below yeah. yeah. Oh, there is. Yeah. Oh, okay. Full carpet, now, so this must be on. a... Has it got that storage thing? Yeah, yeah. it does. Okay. How's uh, under the carpet? Or under the mats? See, these, I don't know, oh, they just pop yeah, off. That's up. nice, it's fine. That's kind of a neat... I wonder if that's like an extra deal or something. Um, I think the last one had that, I can't remember. This is one level higher, so... Does it feel good? Mm -hmm. Shut the door and does it feel like the other one, I guess? Oh yeah, it's not the same. Well, I don't know, but the first time I started it, it makes a big tapping sound. I, I just, my truck doesn't do that. I don't know if that's how new trucks do it. And I turned it off and turned it back on, but of course it didn't do it then. But I think you'll be able to hear it from the cut where it bends at the back. You could still hear it. Um, maybe I can loop it a time or two, but it is a, uh, so I, I'm not even going to take it on the road. I'm just going to uh, say we're done with it. I'm going to start it one more time, see if it'll do it. It was fine. Well, we took it for a test drive, and it seems fine. It's quiet, runs good, air works good. I mean, it did make a tick when we first started it and they showed us that all the new Rams, 2019s and newer make a tick when you start it. So just for a few seconds. Um, drives nice, no smoke, 
So we're comfortable. It's just a matter of price now. All right. Well, we did not buy the truck. I really liked it too, you know. But you got to be able to walk away. That's why I really don't like driving three, four hours to check out a vehicle because you're so invested at that point in time. You just want to be able to walk away if you can't make a deal. Um, they wanted 40600 So I said, hey, will they knock 1000 off just to get things started, you know? And so she's like, no, nah, I don't think so. So she priced it all out. And I said, well, would they knock the 600 Let's just do an even 40 40 grand, you know? And it's been here for, what did you say, a month? Yeah. Yeah, it's been sitting here for a month. And uh, actually, somehow they racked up a thousand miles on the vehicle in that month. But anyhow, um, she said we would take 250 off to earn your business, but that's as much as they would be willing to do. Then just thought it's a, uh, would you say it's an insult? Yeah, come on. Yeah, it's like 250. We're 40 grand. They can't. Yeah, 40 grand. Are you serious? Not asking for a lot, just a reasonable, yeah. you know. The grand was just to. Yeah. To see what they're working but, with, yeah. but they're just being nice. Right, because well, you know, when they priced it at forty and six hundred, they put the six hundred there to knock it just off. Just to knock it off, the you know. That's so. just to round it up to you know forty thousand. Yeah. Just so you know, I think they boost it like that, just so you know, they knock it off so the person feels good. That's all you want. Is feel like you got a yeah. Well, some I feel like they're just to, being nice to me to yeah. earn my business to knock right, $200 off. Right, that's what she said, off. they'll knock 250 off. So. so it's kind of funny, we're driving home and we're just talking about, you know, all these cars I think that'll be coming on market. And lo and behold, they call up, it's the dealership, it's the manager. And, uh, you know, what else can we do to get you in the car right now? And the sticking point is 350 bucks. That's the difference. They came down 250 out of the 600, and I said, "Well, look, you know, we're at 350 dollar difference. Let's split that." She's like, "Well, I'll go down another 50." Uh, so it's like I'm talking about a forty thousand dollar yeah, car. Yeah, forty thousand dollar car that they're going to pay cash for right now. Yeah, that 300 bucks less, and I would give them a check for it. I can't believe that they're going back and forth. I, to me, you think 300 bucks, they would just uh, eat that just to do the deal, get it over with. But to earn our business. Yeah. To, as they it's say. Like, I don't know. You know, at this point, it just kind of irks you that, you know, she's like, well, it's our policy not to discount. Well, I understand. There's a lot of people buying trucks, but they sure have a whole bunch of them on their lot to sell. So Ben wanted to hold tough, so we're holding tough. I thought I was generous splitting the 300 with them, you know. Wouldn't do that. Wouldn't do that. Another 150 bucks, and we'd have that truck today. So then at that point, they're like, wouldn't do it for uh, 450, is it? Where? 350. Yeah, it's 600 even. That's yeah. Right. Yep. So then she came down 50. So you know, like it's basically a hundred bucks. The deal is stuck for a hundred bucks. We don't need a truck that yeah, bad. Right. A... I mean, at this point, it's like a hundred bucks. It's just not even. You know, it'll cost more to put fuel in the thing than a hundred bucks. So. <laughs> now it's a point of uh, pride, right? It's a grudge man. Yeah. I mean, if they're gonna call Ben us doesn't bad, want to. Ben doesn't want to give in now for a hundred. Wow. Yeah, no, I get it. Look at all those trucks. Bill, look at all those bad boys. Well, all the trucks are up here. Yeah. Right there. There's trucks all over, so. Our trucks run great, man, we fixed that. Here, show. Woo! <laughs> if you guys seen that video before where we uh, fixed the fan, it, it blows nice and cold. 